here now the dictionary bnat what is the meaning of marketing myopia is some organizations ignore the fact that to be successful the wants of customers must be their central consideration some organizations not all organizations is talking about some of the organizations are forgetting actual what the customer wants is important they are forgetting about this particular concept and they are releasing the products according to their own development point of view or their own what are the they manufacture it without looking the customers considerations if you are delivering the product into the market we won't get success meaning is some organizations are ignoring the fact what is the fact the fact is called the customers always looks for the a right product at right time a right product at the right time they are looking for it so how do you deliver such type of product is more important that's the marketing way of it is shorts cited an inward looking approach to marketing that focuses on the needs of firm instead of defining the firm and its product in terms of customer needs and wants so shorts cited an inward looking approach so the products what are you delivering to market only for short term benefit point of view if the the company is delivering the product in a short term point of view also the problem comes short sighted and inward looking approach to marketing that focus on needs of firm instead of defining the firm and its products in terms of customer needs overall thing is called the, the bigger one what do you have is called based on customer needs and wants they are supposed to deliver the, the product is so myopia is a word one it allows us to analyze the marketing what are the how called market do you have what type of proxy you have all these things are possible to analyze it using the this particular study is for example look at this call are you are you talking about here now call are you concerned about customers or not the company would like to know about all these things every company would like to know the the products are which are delivering according to customer demand or something is a forcing them to purchase it example we are now call it we are using a the company is using a, some the film actor in the ad promotion so the impact will be there for some time later on the impact won't be there that means call the impact have shown only for some for only for some time so that should be overcome right that means account the need we didn't deliver the item is just you deliver the item and you are forcing the customer to purchase it there are some items are there it's not like that only you know there are no items there are items which we look into the examples also let's see some examples they are nothing on us that could never happen to us they are our own competitors somebody says that is the who is a competitor there are no competitors we are only competitors for us so that is also a one type of the thing is called so what what is required here now we should feel competitors competition as well as we have to deliver the product account the market is customers love our product or service regardless of what happens is they will buy whatever we will sell to them this type of attitude that allows that allows us to understand that is called here now we are not following the marketing myopia is okay the example what you have is called pepsi cola is a good example of which marketing and, and management myopia is absent is so this type the, these two products in initial time they used to sell it even though call in the beginning time the cooling used to sell for 10 rupees so people used to think about uh, can we have a cooling for 5 rupees 8 rupees like that then company started manufacturing of the small uh, 5 rupees and 8 rupees now there is no value for 5 rupees uh, if you see then is bad there is big value so that time is called 5 rupees bottles and 8 rupees bottles also used to come right on that bottle made as 20 rupees now right now 20 rupees bottle was the only 8 rupees initial time pepsi cola's diversification into other markets initially you now only cool drink now we can see various products are there mirinda is there as well as diet coke is there and you can see find out tropicana is there all these things how based on the customers needs they have changed it and there are two items are there the most important thing is called product and commodity the two words are very important <clears throat> product and commodity what is even the product is this is a one 
Product is called what the customer feels about your business is product is. What the customer feeling about your business is a product. Commodity means a commodity is anything which is there is a demand, but which is supplied without qualitative differentiation across the market is. So without worry about quality, just you have delivered the item. That's called commodities. Anything which there is a demand, whatever the demand is there, just you're manufacturing and leasing it, right? Without quality differentiation across a, a market is. So what is what you have is the customer feels about your business, this entire business, what is the feeling is, right? Example, Tata products, right? So that is a, you are now called about businesses, we have positive. About positive only we have, that's why we got positive approach comes whenever you see the Tata products are. Based on this product and commodity, let's see the example here. The product means here now a feel good thrust quencher, right? And here now that's the thing is called. Commodity is called a soft drink item. What is the item is called? Soft drink. So product means called, what they're looking is called, a, can I have a, a good thrust quencher? Can I get it? The commodity is a soft drink is. This is one more example. Sometimes if you are not understanding the myopia, you'll fail. The best example always comes is called Kodak. Kodak is the best example. Kodak Film Company is a great example which marketing myopia was absent, completely absent. Because of when the digital started coming from Sony as well as the Canon like that, Kodak really adapted the new technology. They said, no, no, it won't allow uh, to get the success. But immediately what happened is called Kodak didn't view the Sony as a potential company, as a potential competitor and failed in the market. It's now there are no product products are there. So it's failed, product is, product is from the Korea and the Sony is from the Japan. So product is, product is for capturing movements is a product and commodity is a film. The film is called digital film is coming. So digital one allows us to take the as many snaps as possible. Well, if you see called Max, product Max is only short photos are possible. So very immediately delivery is possible as you see called digital one while in the traditional uh, type of camera is not possible. You need to go to the shop and you need to clean that paper, then only it comes. So a long time processing one. Colors is called shadow obsolescence, population with production pressures, dangers of R&D. There are all the causes. They should upgrade themselves. They should have a R&D section. Then only it is possible. There's a lot of production pressure also would be there. And population myth also. The myth what you have is your assumption that people won't go to the new products. People never use the traditional products. People never show interest in traditional way of the usage of commodities are. People always want the new ones. So if you're able to manufacture a new item and if you're able to merge, okay, two or three items which are already exist one, then you can say the new item, then people will purchase it. If you're still purchasing the new old company and wants to Deliver the same old items, no one purchases it. It's a waste of the time and money is. Always think in a new direction where new type of the things are possible. Even in software also we have like this one, with new type of software, new features. Okay, so what you have is called integrating the new two or three features, companies and bringing, all these things are required when you're making the software also. So what you have is called, suppose now automation required. What is, this one is called automation. So product is automation, commodity is nothing but a software. Okay, product is office automation and product is nothing but a you know, software. Is. Which company use, purchase it, that depends on that. Okay. So lessons we learn is companies need to know the difference between a product and commodity, what a customer feels about business, this product, or a commodity is anything which is very demanding. So modern relevance is we live within a society that is fast paced, continuously evolving, Consumers seek instant gratification. Competition is rife. Companies either have to evolve or accommodate consumer needs or die. So what do you have? So fast pace, okay, okay. development is very fast. Okay, we are living in such a society that they develop so much of development is going is very fast. We're going very fast, right? Continuously evolving. We are not a constant one. Look at the symbol, you can see his symbol. See. Continuously evolving happening. Consumers seek instant gratification. They want to get immediate satisfaction. Competition is rife. What is meaning of rife? Right? So competition is very bigger one. It's very bigger. Okay. It's called rife. Okay. So which is widespread. 
Rife means wide spread. It is called rife. Competition is very wide spread. It so so much of competition is there, right? So as an example, your job also. People are you are fighting. You are you want to get a job. So then what you are doing here now? You are facing so much of competition. The skills what are you have is not sufficient. The company is asking, come on, more skills show me more knowledge you have or not. Prove it. Then I give job to you, right? That's called you are now called competition is very rife. Companies either have to evolve or accommodate consumer needs or that. Okay, you should go for it. Here, dying is not negative word. They should close it. Otherwise, if you are unable to do it, you need to close it. Examples many are there. Kodak Company is the best example. HMT Motors, like this, we have Alvin is the best example we have in our portfolio. Alvin was a so much famous company in the fridge manufacturing. So there are changes have come at last because competition has come from the parent company Samsung. Or the whole LG because to face they, they cannot here now all we didn't face such type of competition and close right so this is a major thing comes here also so what you have is you should evolve yourself and deliver the products according to the demand right the technology should be adapted otherwise you know very difficult so look at this is called unconventional management is conventional management is symptom of marketing and management myopia. Because the system which managers are groomed is indiscriminate of whom it captures and whose mind it handicaps by restricting their thinking to tried and tested so the thought processes. Look at that on an example what is unconventional management, right? We need unconventional management, compassion. Conventional management, what happens is called they always grow in the old ideas like this. Way. Example, what you have is called the old, the person who is becoming a old in the entrepreneurship process. The CEO, what he does is because he gives the rights to the, the next generation person is his son or his war is there. He gives up gives back to that person. Is. That is most important. So conventional management is a symptom of marketing and management myopia because of system which manager groom is in this current form of whom it captures and whose mind handicaps, but it's still thinking to tried and tested thought processes, right? Example, once upon a time in the college also, we used to give advertisement in newspapers, right? Newspapers, all these things. So TV channels, we didn't give an advertisement. Only in newspapers, we used to give job alerts. Right now, we don't have, we're not using it. So we have shifted. Right now, it's website or social media. Recently, we have given the advertisement in the social media. Example, right now, you can find it in the, what are the requirements do you have? In the college job opportunities, we have given Indeed, Indeed.com. And previously, I have given the LinkedIn. So LinkedIn, we have used it. Facebook, we used it. Indeed, we are using it, right? So slowly, we have shifted to the new type of the media to announce about the, the recruitments, what you have in the colleges. Otherwise, if still, if you're stuck onto the paper, no, you won't get anything. Because paper, no one is purchasing the paper, it's newspapers. So we need to shift. So what you have is the unconventional management is the practices are implementing in the colleges. Adding marketing myopia is needs, wants, and demands, products, services, value, satisfaction, quality, exchange, transaction, relationship, markets. There is a cycle we can find it out. And the conclusion we will find it out is the problem that exists in the world today cannot be solved by level of thinking and created them by them. Okay, that created them. So, what are the level of thinking? What you have is called that is not sufficient to solve the problems. Is. That means simple one go beyond. We think beyond actual our level, then only it is possible you can solve it. To ensure continuous growth for our company, concentrate on marketing, meeting customers' needs rather than the selling the products. Instead of you sell the products to the customer, identify the customer needs as much as possible, then only continuous growth is a possibility. Okay.